Grab your loot too. So that was... Whoops. Uh, the majority of them. Oh, hello. <laughs> was that all of them that were over here? Or is there still a one, like one or two? Yeah, that was all of them. Nice. Well, we unintentionally did the entire map in like two combat, well, three combats, the very first one we took out solo. Oofed. I think I'm on easy mode with the full healing, otherwise I'd, I'd be so super boned and out of stuff because I'd have to buy all these medkits and use them all the time. But man. So this area, which I think you're locked and this is the quarantine zone, yeah. Man, I was excited. I was hoping that was a key for back, back a while. Those ruins in the distance. That's the Forbidden City. A terrible place. Oh, back there. Forbidden City. Okay. Oh, med kit. One. One med kit. That's it. Okay, I mean, I guess that'd be cool if I was on a harder difficulty where I don't fully heal, but uh, even then, that only heal like one person, so still not really that worth it, I think. Welcome to your future. Huh. To your new life. I'll, uh, I'll pull another little lap, and then we'll head back to the Ark, see what's new in the shop, and then come back here and continue on toward finding Hammond. Hammond? Hammond. Hammond. Thank you for writing. As your search for Hammond leads you deeper into the zone, you are seeing things I've never told you about. Strange things. I have withheld certain facts from you because, well, your innocence gives you hope, and the Ark needs hope. But you ask questions, so I will give answers. When the world fell apart, a few of humanity's best and brightest constructed hidden bases where they could survive. These bases were called enclaves. One was deep beneath the ground, another at the bottom of the sea, a third orbiting the planet. The best and brightest, trapped inside their enclaves, grew paranoid, then hostile. They created machines that did everything for them. Metal monstrosities that granted their every wish, except immortality. The ancients' best and brightest all died. But their machines remain. Survive and persevere, my brave stalkers. Uh, I've withheld some things from you. Uh, cough, cough, sputter. People built these robots. Cough, sputter. Um, yeah, duh. Okay. Whatever. Welcome. If you want zone gear, I've got it. A red eye for crit chance is the new thing. Ugh, for 120 though, Until God. Next time. I don't know, maybe. Someone told me they saw a machine that walks on two legs out there. Looks like a metal man, they say. Hey, I'm not surprised. The ancients left behind a lot of wacko stuff. I'm seeing wacko stuff a lot lately. You stupid idiot, you're literally working on one of them. Oh my god. Does is it do they do it on purpose? Is is that the joke? Or Oh god. The weapon. I never found any weapon. Oh yeah, I did find a weapon about the guaranteed knockback. That's why I'm here. Which I could give to since you never really Crit with this anyway, that's not really a selling point for it. 
100% knockback. Or, I could give that to the Slinger also. Let's give that to the Slinger. So you can have that back, I guess. Chance to burn. Still a cool thing. And weapon parts, we will upgrade. Ugh. I guess the crossbow. So now we can do 15 stealth damage, I think. You look thirsty. And I never grabbed a new artifact. Okay. So we head back out. Uh, right down here. And move on to unexplored location. And then when I run into an itch, uh, an itch, an situation, when I run into a situation where things are suddenly like really tough and stuff and I have really nowhere else to go, then I'll check out the unexplored stuff. It feels weird doing that because again, it's just like, that's just a weapon that I'm missing out on. Ah, this leads to a good few things actually. We've got, these are the cult lands and this brings us down to some sort of a weird bird crow thing and then a strange churchy thing and then the the world ender apparently where Hammon is which could actually be the end of the game thinking about it because we've already found half the artifacts and uh, roughly half of the notes could be could be could be like that's a little thing and then this is a, a couple parts so there's a couple artifacts out there and I don't know I had heard that this game was pretty short no one from the Ark has ever ventured this far south and returned. We're true pioneers. Or dead meat. There is like absolutely nothing up here. So through this gate. Would we get ambushed? No? Okay. Sort of expected something to happen there. It looked like a pretty okay ambush spot. Like maybe the enemies ambushed me for a change. Some ghouls are guarding the gate. Ooh. Time to do what we do best. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay, so we'll sneak around a little. There's a pyro and a butcher. Butcher with 14 health. Was I able to handle that? Uh, yeah, the Rambino and the needle pistol. You've got the ancient pistol for five. And you can have the crossbow for five. But keep the shotguns. Ah, keep the sh yeah, that, that, that's okay. So we got 5, 10, 15 damage stealth. So we can potentially take out that butcher, but the power will definitely be alerted. But the game tends to do this thing where you approach them and they start talking and then they'll split up and start uh, patrolling. So we'll see about doing that. A weapon of war this was. Pure armor plated destruction. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Just yep. I like that about this game. I like its sense of humor. And that brings us out to. Not sure. Let's check it out though. We'll take a peek. See what it is. This is the bird icon. The Grog Den. Drinking seems to have been an important part of life, also to the ancients. They collected their drinks in small flasks, sometimes made of glass. Once in a while, it's possible to find one. That's... Once in a while, it's possible to find one that is still unopened? Um... Uh, sure, yes. Yes, it is. Uh, yeah, that's Grog. Guaranteed, up ahead. Mm, smells good. Real good. Hammond told me about this place. He called it the Grog Den. The ancients used to brew magic grog here, he said. <laughs> I could use a little grog right now. No. No, you don't get any. We'll come here if we need to. Uh, I'm not doing a bunch of optional stuff. The combat just makes me upset nowadays. So I'd, I'd like to avoid doing it when I can. <laughs> it's just 
there's so many really strange rules that the game has that I don't quite understand, like shooting your gun. Shooting your gun doesn't always alert people. It depends on the direction you shoot. Like uh, the missed bullet so alerts people. So what? Brain boy's not gonna find me. My skull's too thick. I told you to split it with me. Tell me what happened. Did you see the ancients? Hell no. I saw some purple, and the purple laughed at me. So I started laughing. Then I took a piss. That felt real good. So what's the big deal? Sacred mushrooms. <laughs> Stupid Nova sect. Phonies! Alright. So a tank guy, he'd be a cool one to mind control with, uh, I think it was two hunters? Or maybe a hunter from Pyro. But let's back out a bit, because I don't want to aggro them. I'd like to just come over here. Let's try to get these guys talking and see what they do. Try to take somebody out stealthily. I want to party, man! I don't want to work for the Nova sect! Why are we doing this? Watch what you say. The ancients are watching us, you blank. So shut up. Everybody fan out. Back to work. Okay, cool. He's walking this way. So I would have thought so. How far over do you go? Just to this wall. Yeah. And then do you walk back? No, you walk up. Gives me a chance to get even closer. Alrighty. Blessed be the ancients. Use my body as your vehicle for vengeance. Find the thief among us. Strike him down. We'll ambush from here. So I think you guys might be able to walk up on him and get a shot if you can't see him now. Yeah, you can see him now. Okay. So let's go for this then. Just shoot him. Good crit. Makes things a little bit nicer. Good crit. Makes things a little bit nicer. Good crit. Oh, damn it. <laughs> hey, I never know. Maybe. Okay, we took out a guy. Follow me. Fucking yes. It feels good when you can do that. But man, you really gotta. You really. If if you play this game, you gotta upgrade those silenced weapons. They are the most important thing. It makes stuff so much easier when you can just stealthily take out a dude. Because again, originally I was under the impression that you had to take them out. Like, in one shot. Because, you know, you shoot them and they get the alert symbol. And I thought, oh, well, that just alerted, alerted their entire pack. But it, it doesn't. I don't need an assist. Fuck. I pressed the wrong button. I, I left-clicked instead of right-clicked because the right-click didn't do anything the first time. That was close. Technically, we don't need cover, per se. But... It would be cool. We'll ambush and just go for a mind control right off the bat, right? That should work. It'll end your turn. It's only 75%. Okay, cool. We got him. So then, can we activate everybody else and, like, just jump you off? Run out, like... I don't know, generally just a bit away from us. So I'd like to not be set on fire. <laughs> oh, right, I can't shoot people I've mind-controlled, right.
forgot about that. Overwatch. So we'll just have to overwatch. Let's run you down here. Throw your grenade, just waste it. That shouldn't alert anybody, you're so far out. Okay, so now we can hit him. He's unfor whoops, unfortunately behind a bit of cover. Could also maybe go loud. Those guys are pretty far away. Could maybe go loud, because I'm shooting down in this direction, right? The direction you shoot seems to matter a bunch. We learned that last time. So if we blast him like this, starting with Pharaoh, or we twitch shot. Yeah, now nah, let's start with fair. Let's see if we need the twitch shot. Could be we don't even need to if we get some nice crits. Nice. Nobody alerted? Okay, cool. Just fire weapon. And it looks like we won't even need the twitch shot, so that's nice. Nobody missed. All right. Well, that worked out pretty well. I, I feel pretty good about that. That's nice. Mutation-wise, you're... I'm pretty happy with you, I think, right? There wasn't anything else I wanted to change. Because we got the... Uh, the cool cover for the passive, the minor being twitch shot, and the major being tree hugger, I think, right? I'm okay with that. Oh, yeah, there's Alpinus that I was thinking about getting. It's really a toss-up between these two. I really don't know. I think I might just start going for the more health and all that, because, I mean, low cover counting is high cover. That That's that's a big one. So we'll just, there you go. Spend mutations on health. Magnus, you've got the cool passive, which doesn't help a whole lot. Sneak for a minor. Yeah, maybe puppeteer for the major. I think I'm keeping that. Yeah, let's just go more health. Just get health on people. I, I think skill-wise, I think we're okay. Especially Pharaoh. She's she's totally fine. It's a massive barn here. A wild shadow. Is that just like a wind turbine? Maybe. Slowly spinning. This barn, which they've got a fancy thing in there. Let's split up. How many times have I told you that the mushrooms are sacred tools for my mind, not yours? My mind is good mind. Mind. Your mind is nothing. We need to get as much food as possible into the sanctum before the cleansing of the Ark. Now get to work. My mind, nothing. This, nothing my mind be. Nothing my mind be. You brain dead simpleton. Just leave. Go on patrol. Okay, we're all hiding in the high ground. We'll see where the butcher goes. I could maybe pick him off. He's also just got 14 health. Brother Lundgren, the last brother I fought, he did the... What did he have? He had like a lightning attack, didn't he? Something like that. 
Okay, and he, he doesn't really patrol very far at all. So we, may, we might be stuck fighting these guys as is. Now I hear a robot stomping around outside also. Which I'm going to just assume is a medbot. Uh, yeah, I don't think we'd be able to take him out from there. Thought maybe if we hang out... Well, okay, hold on. Now, out there... Now, that's a possibility. Okay. Okay, so we'll do that. We'll see if I can take that guy out outside, and then that'll leave just the hunter and the brother dude in here, and then there's a robot outside that I might have to take, take a look at. I see another shadow back there. It looks like it could be a tank or something. I don't know. So like here, maybe. We'll activate people. We could potentially do Puppeteer again, <laughs> just mind control, 100% chance to mind control him. But uh, I think I might see about mind controlling the Hunter and just get the brother down as quickly as possible. And Puppeteer required how many kills to reset? I think it was like two or something. So we'll hold off on that. Um, to get this guy, I think I'll have to, yeah, I'll have to move up with people and just get him. Okay, yeah, I'm so paranoid of it all fucking up somehow. Like, oh, the enemy heard your shot. Still, like, I don't know. It's weird. And th th with the whole alert symbol and the enemy heard you, it, I don't know. I, g I get scared, okay? <laughs> so we'll hold off on the group inside and try to take this group, maybe? Ooh, shit. Okay, there's a shaman out here. Come on, guys, let's go. 24 health shaman. Him, I might have to, uh, might have to mind control him before he can do anything too wild. We got Magnus back here for the mind control. So we can maybe shoot him with the other two people, then mind control him, pull him way back with us. And, um, maybe finish him off, like, way out in the middle of nowhere. You know? So we'll activate. Okay, just 75%, so we'd have to get a little bit closer. Someone might be okay, though. No, also 75. Fine. But someone can get up to the log and shoot. Pharaoh can get up to just the middle of nowhere and shoot. F fine. It says that he won't be alerted if you move here, interestingly. I don't know how that would be, but okay, I'll take it. So, yeah, shoot him. Nice crit. Salma, scoot up. Yeah, caught sneaking. So your crit chance is a bit shit. And Magnus will try for a mind control. 75%. And then with him, we'll just run way down here, away from everybody else. Like, far away from everybody else. <laughs> Maybe that was too far, actually. Because the mind control's, uh, it's not that long. Slowest sprint ever. We'll run out there and we'll see if we can take him out loudly. Enemy turn. Uh huh. Now he's. He's back. He has 15 health but one armor, so I don't think I can. Uh, 
don't think I can continue being sneaky about it. But I don't think I need to anymore. Say my name, Jizzwipe. It's Farrow. Blam. Big crit. And nobody's looted. Good, 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 good. And just to be safe, finish him off with this. Don't get up. Okay. Leveled again. Well done. <laughs> well, well, well done, me. I did it. Did that give us? Yeah, you can get the health boost. Okay.